All right, uh, day 21, here we go, let's do it. Okay, first up, we're gonna start off, this is a full practice routine day, it's gonna be awesome, and we're gonna get our game in shape. We're gonna start off on the putting green, start with your 2 T uh, drill, or just your uh, little putting aid, warm up your stroke, let's go. All right, good stuff. Now what I want you to do is do three foot circles, just with 20 in a row, that's it. Just get 20 in a row. We're just kind of getting our full game in shape, all right? You got this, because you just did 50 last time. 20, let's do it. See how easy that is now? Uh, let's move on, we're gonna go chip some. Okay, we're gonna start off uh, chipping just short chip shots. I'm using my 60 degree wedge, but use whatever wedge you feel comfortable with. I'm just going uh, from here to here. Short guys, one bag, let's do it. Uh, the main piece of advice I would give is keep your weight on your front foot here, accelerate through the ball, you got it. Uh, let me know if you like the balls I'm using too. Uh, these are Volvic, uh, I got the S3, S4 Vivid and the Vivid Soft I believe. Let's move on. Okay, now we're gonna do one bag shag, chip and runs. And I'm just gonna put my putter on the green. It's a little crowded out here. And uh, this gives me a larger area kind of to aim at, which is great for these chip and runs, so. There, now I'm kind of out of everybody's way. Going to my putter out there, uh, one bag shag. I'm using a pitching wedge this time. I like using my putter because you know, I can see it pretty well and it's what, 36 inches long-ish, 34 I think, so it's a roughly three feet. That's the distance you wanna be from the hole. So if you're in that putter length every time, you're good and so much easier to visualize that. So something to consider. crushing it let's move on the bunkers a mess uh, but that's okay we're gonna hit all you're gonna do out of the bunker today is 10 shots uh, this bunker has hardly any sand in it so I'm glad I have my 60 degree with four degrees of bounce no bounce very little bounce when there's no sand in the bunker all right that'll help you out you don't want that bounce to hit and hit the hard pen and ricochet off it's just equipment issues there well bunker issues too but whatever 10 shots let's go easy just trying to get a feel trying to shape your whole game just a little bit okay uh, let's hit it we're gonna hit the uh, the range now <sighs> okay we're at the range obviously uh, get your pitching wedge nine iron eight iron you're gonna hit ten shots each three-quarter swing let's go Good day today, long day. Last thing, get your seven iron. 20 shots, that's it, easy, right? If you have leftover balls, save them for next time you'll need them. Or just hit whatever you want. Either way, if you don't steal. Don't steal, just bar, whatever. You do your thing. Uh, we're gonna hit uh, two fade, two draw, two, two, two fade, two draw, two fade, two draw, 20 balls, seven irons. Like I said, always say, if you can't draw it, 
whatever draw equals in your book. If you can't fade it, same exact thing. Whatever is a fade for you. If you normally draw it 10 yards, five yard draw would be your fade. Make sense? So, you got this. Just feel your swing, getting, getting, getting those scores down. Always go to target. I'm gonna go at the 150 sign, right there. Fades and draws, here we go. You did it. Day 21 in the books. We have one more week to go. Three more practice days and you, sh you should be, have lowered your, your game by five strokes. Let me know how it's going, where you're at right now. You should be really close, especially putting. I've gotten a lot of comments with you guys really improving those short putts, overall, even all your putts. So great job. Today was a little bit of everything. <sighs> I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for your support. Keep crushing it.